I'm back. I'm back. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Vanessa's van life journey. I am Vanessa and I live in a van and her name is Treasure. How are you guys doing today? Come on in and thumbs up the video if you're my friend. I'm eating some leftovers from Applebee's. I went to Applebee's yesterday. And I did a I did a food review and I ordered their chicken fiesta. I don't have a knife to cut it right now. Mm hmm. So we're just gonna bite it like that, girl. So, anywho, I wanted to turn the chat on and chat with y'all. So the chat is opened up. Let's see who's gonna be the first person to leave a comment. I'm going to be putting on my makeup and doing a facial first today. So, I already did a manicure. This is the polish I chose for my manicure. This is a Sally Hansen color. I think it's 570. And I also did my toes and I painted them black. So. I pretty much did a dry manicure. Just file my nails. Cut my manicure. I mean cut my uh, cuticle. Hey Miss Rhonda. You the first person to comment, girl. Thank you for being here. I'm doing a self-care day today. Was you in the other live? Was you in the other live? Okay. I turned off my lights when I went walking just now from the main circuit and now it keeps going on and off. You was cooking, what did you cook? I, I did my uh, nails, my toenails black, but girl, I got polish everywhere. I have to clean them up. So I'm about to do a facial, but I'm hungry. So I had to eat first. Um, made a chicken salad, blackened chicken and garlic pasta. Sounds delicious. I wish I was there so I could get a plate, girl. 
sounds delicious. How is baby girl doing today? Y'all thumbs up the live stream. Hello, Miss Rachelle. Mmm. You got to put a roast on. Girl, what you cooking all that food for? What you cooking all that food for, girl? Hey, Miss Devano. Happy today, what? Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. What's today, y'all? Meal prep for my honey. Okay. I'm not sure if I tasted lamb before. What restaurant is a good restaurant to go taste some lamb? Today, Wednesday? Okay. What day is a good day to go taste some lamb? Hey, Mr. Loris. It's actually really good. Anybody know a restaurant I can go to? Who does lamb? Hey, Miss Jamila. What are you eating? About to get off work and make some dinner myself. I don't know why I said Miss Jamila. I mean Jordan. What I was eating. <laughs> uh, leftovers from Applebee's. I don't know why they think keep doing that. I shouldn't have turned it off from that plug. Note to self, Vanessa, never do that again. What you gonna be doing? Cooking. You hungry too? I just got through doing me a manicure on the other channel. I'm trying to look feminine like a lady, y'all. I'm trying to look like a lady. <laughs> hey there, Miss Ortiz. Miss Ortiz say made spaghetti with chicken, chopped meat. Weather is very bad today. Very rainy, very windy, and it's Wednesday, 5, 53 p.m. Hey, Miss Ortiz. Boodles, how are you doing, girl? Welcome to the chat. I appreciate you guys coming in, you lovely ladies joining me. Thumbs up the video. Your nails are cute. Thank you. I painted my toes black, but they look scary right now because it's polished everywhere. Baby girl, say you do look like a lady. Thank you, girl. Thank you, boo. That's a pretty color. This is Sally Hansen color 570. 
It's a neutral. Uh, your nails came out pretty. Going to make some stovetop lasagna. Oh, stovetop lasagna. Very pretty. I'm eating lunch right now also. So I am doing a self-care day today. I did my nails earlier. And now I'm about to do a facial. Y'all know I put my mask on. So I'm not going to put my mask everywhere today. Sometimes I put it on my face, my hands, my feet. Today I'm just going to do my face and my neck. And I also do my head sometimes. Because we got these dreads. We can't do our head. So. I'm finished with all my leftovers. From. Applebee's. Video coming soon on the channel. Uh, so. I need a container to mix up my mask in. So let me get one of my, oh, I was gonna say I got this empty jar right here, but it ain't empty. But I think I got one over there. But that'll be. Y'all see my shirt? Y'all see my shirt? Tell me what my shirt say. Tell me what my shirt say, girl. Tell me what my shirt say. Who see my shirt? Tell me what it say, girl. Okay, I'm gonna try to get. Oh, let me try to get one of these things up out of here without moving. It's gonna be hard to do. Oh, I don't know why they think you keep going off. Why you keep doing that, girl? Oh, I'm gonna have to move this thing. I don't wanna have to move this thing. I don't want to have to move it. Ugh. Haters give you energy. Haters give you energy. Look, y'all. Haters give me energy. I got so much energy, girl. Them haters trying to keep up, keep up with me. They can't keep up with me because they give me energy. I already got a lot of energy. <laughs> and then they give me more energy. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey, Miss Carol. Hey there, hot grease. Hey, just give me energy. <laughs> I got so much energy. <laughs> I got so much energy. They like, will she go to sleep? No. They like, when do she go to sleep? Don't worry about it. I don't have to sleep. You give me energy. You give me energy. So I ain't got to sleep. I get so much hate. I got so much energy, girl. I ain't never got to go to sleep. Okay. I just need to get this thing out of here. So I can mix up my facial up in here. And then we're going to talk. I got something to talk about. Oh, you know what? While we're doing the facial, we can have us a, a drink. We 
gonna have us a drinky drink. Let's get us a drinky drink. A freezer. Let's get us a drinky drink. And we're gonna do our facial. And we're just gonna have a chills girls day. That's why I wanted to open up the chat. So we could just talk and have a ladies day. Maybe I should have had the chat open in my other live stream when I was doing my nails, but I didn't. So I apologize for the inconvenience, my loves. I apologize, my loves. So I got a little bit, I got a little something, something left over. So, and here's my clean mason jar with the straw. And we got our bottle of ice. This is the way I'm doing the ice today. I'm not going. Uh-oh not frozen all the way it's dripping okay ah I just cut my doggone finger girl I just cut myself y'all I guess next time I should just get the hammer Just cut myself. Hold on. We might as well finish this. Hold on. I just cut myself. Always cutting myself. Hold on, I got a first aid kit. I have to go outside and get that. Let me let me do this. Okay, I got a first aid kit. It's right here. I think Miss Miller sent me this first aid kit years ago. Girl. I sure need to keep a first aid kit handy. Here goes some alcohol pads. Okay, let me keep that there. Let me see what else we got up in here. I don't think I've ever, did I ever open this? I think I did open this. We need Band-Aid. Where's a Band-Aid? I think 
I need a bigger band-aid than that little small one. Do we have some ointment? I know I got some more first aid stuff somewhere. I don't see any ointment to put on here. I'm gonna put a band-aid on it. Hopefully, this one band-aid. Y'all, give me a minute, I cut myself. It's bleeding. I'm going to leave an alcohol pad and another band-aid out just in case this thing is going to be tripping all night. I, I don't understand. I would never turn that thing off from there again. It wasn't doing all that before I turned it off. Now what in the donkey cone is going on? the live so I can read y'all comments. Somebody say they missed the live. I'm letting them know I'm live again. Okay, uh, let me pull up y'all comments. I mean, the live. Okay, let me start from the bottom. Hey, K, Lady K. Uh, Miss Rachel say wrap towels around the scissors. Yeah, I should have did that. Hey, Miss Felicia. Hey, Miss Lolo. I look like I'm having a seizure. <laughs> oh, that's my haters giving me energy. They gave me energy, girl. Okay, y'all, I'm going to do a facial. And if you guys want to know what I use for my facial. I'm gonna have to go get my container too that I bathe in and put some water in it when I get ready to wipe this off. But for now, for now, I, and I have a spatula that's just for my face. So y'all, we're having a little drinky drink. So if anybody want to do a little drinky drink with me this is probably gonna be the last time i do a drinky drink except for like if i go out to a restaurant and i want to try a drinky drink but i don't think i'm gonna buy any more alcohol so don't hold me to it but you know 
I don't think I'm gonna buy no more drinky drink. Oh. So I did have a spatula for my face that I use especially for my face when I do my facials. But I don't see it. So uh, I'm just going to use the back of my phone. I mean my spoon. To put this on my face. So I'm going to take a little. Of this powder. I don't really need that much. Because I'm not going to do. My hands and my feet. And my. My uh. my hair like I normally do it so I have this Aztec clay mask if you look down in my description box below I have a Amazon storefront it's different from my wish list the storefront is things that you guys see me use that you would like to go buy so you can, you can go look at my Amazon storefront and you'll see the exact clay mask and you can order it it's not sponsored however you will see affiliate links in my Amazon storefront when you purchase out of my Amazon storefront I make a few pennies for referring you it doesn't change the cost or the price for you but I do make a few pennies when you shop my Amazon storefront. So y'all go look and have a look in the Amazon storefront. Everything that you see me using and you say, where did you get that from? Where did you get that from? It's in my Amazon storefront usually. Because I usually shop off of Amazon. child I just pulled too much of this stuff up in there wow I did not wow oh, I got the scoop out they need a scoop up in here I just pulled too much now I'm gonna have too much made up So how are y'all doing today? Let me get my phone so I can reach y'all comments. I just made a mess. Yo, we got that stuff everywhere. Uh, hey, Miss uh, Charlene. Bye, you guys. Heading back to work. Lunch is over. I ate fast. Oh well, gonna walk it <laughs> away. Okay, Miss Rochelle, we'll see you later. You have a good work day. So y'all, I wanna uh the title of the live stream is mm -hmm. This is not what we're going to do today. We ain't doing this today. So y'all already know every day, every day, every day. Somebody is trying to get my attention in some kind of way every day every day they just want Vanessa's attention whether it be a small youtuber that want to try to get some clicks and some views off my name whether it be a troll leaving comments on the channel whether it be somebody emailing me think I care about their position I mean their opinion is somebody every day trying to get my attention and what we're not doing today 
We're not responding to you. We not we not giving you no attention. I'm not, I'm just can't. I don't have no attention for y'all people. I am focused on my life, my happiness, my subscribers. I'm focusing on loving those that deserve my love, my kindness, and my attention. I'm not focusing on y'all people who are some misfits <laughs> who like to get attention through bad reactions. I'm not I'm not focusing on that. I'm not focusing on the people who dislike me and have an opinion about me. And you constantly watch me but you don't like me. I'm not focusing on y'all. I'm focusing on the people that are in the chat because they're not blocked. <laughs> And the ones that want to come in here and get blocked, you can go on, come up in here today. Hey, Gary. You got to go to church? Okay, thank you for stopping by. I am also having a cheeky beverage as well, Vanessa. Okay, girl. You thinking of purchasing the clay mask? So that's what we're doing today. We're doing a facial. I don't know where my uh, my other, let me find my, I think the other one is over there somewhere. My, uh, my thing for my head. Okay, let me cool. Let me put this on. But that's what we're not doing, y'all. We I'm not I'm not participating in the foolishness. The new Vanessa turning over a new leaf. I'm gonna sit here and do my face darling with my spoon and my container. And I'm going to wash it afterwards. And you can talk about it and make videos about me doing what I want to do on my channel if you want to. I'm not giving you my my permission, but uh, you're going to have to answer to God. And I just can't. I can't. I can't. You just can't. Something's not worth your time, your energy your focus like I don't understand how focusing on me is worth it for you in your life for your mental health for your mental health for your well-being for your relationship with God I don't understand how focusing on me is gonna help you get to heaven but obviously <laughs> Some of y'all ain't trying to get to heaven, so I guess since you ain't trying to go to heaven anyway, go on mess with Vanessa. <laughs> Cause you ain't trying to go to heaven anyway. So what do y'all think about these people that's hollering and screaming and having temper tantrums every day trying to get my attention? trying to get my attention do y'all watch youtubers that y'all don't like if you tune into a youtuber channel and you eventually don't like their content do you continue to watch them do you go to their channel and leave comments on their channel? Do you go to hate groups? Do you go form a hate group against them? Uh, I joined Fitch. You joined Fitch, girl? Let me see. You just not joined? 
You just not joined, girl. I cashed in. I cashed in my fetch the other day, girl. I got $60. I went on Amazon and bought me some drawers. <laughs> Y'all know I want to change my drawers collection to all black. So I bought me some black drawers. Yes, focus on positivity. Have a good evening. I got to go now. Okay, Gary, enjoy church. We might still be here when you get back. Don say, I joined Fetch. Uh, Miss Doris say, hey, Vanessa, I have the clay mask and I love it. I am sitting here looking out my window while it's hailing outside. Girl, it's hailing. We had everything but snow this weekend. Wow. One of my subscribers told me they had snow yesterday in Chicago. Miss Carol say, nope. Uh, Miss Lola say, I refuse to give my energy away to what does not serve me. That's just a waste of time. And girl, that is where I'm at. That's what we're not doing. That's that's a good phrase to coin, Miss Lola. That's what we're not doing. We're not giving our energy to things that do not serve us. That is a waste of time, girl. You know what's serving me right now? I did a manicure today, a pedicure today, a facial today. I'm going to do my makeup, and I'm going to sit here, and I'm going to drink this. Drink, and I'm going to talk to my subscribers, the ones who love me, the other ones that are subscribed to my channel out of hate. Oh, girl, you don't serve me. Your hate, your jealousy, your negativity, your animosity your lack of love for God because you can't be serving him if you hate me and hating on me you can't you can't so it doesn't serve me it doesn't serve me Miss Lola thank you for the comment Vanessa I don't watch that foolery <laughs> they are stalking your every move and are obsessed darling well you know i was just asking y'all do y'all watch people that you if you are not interested in a person's content do you keep watching them even though you don't like them girl i'm sub i'm i'm unsubscribing to somebody channel fast quicker in a hurry I will unsubscribe to your channel. I'm not going to leave you no comment. I'm not going to send you no email. I'm not going to talk about you. I'm just unsubscribing, girl. I am listening to you. And I am at work. I will do my clay mask once I am at home. Miss Carol say, we had a tornado today. Wow. Did it, did it touch down? It is cold here today and windy. Y'all having some bad weather, girl. Y'all need to move. I need everybody to move to Texas. We're going to start a... <laughs> we're going to start a compound in Texas. I need all of y'all to move to Texas with y'all trailers. <laughs> you skipped my... I am blocked. Uh, your comment did not show up, Miss Marie. Sometimes YouTube do not show your comments. So I'm not sure what your first comment was, but the first one I see is you saying, I skipped your comment, are you blocked? No, you are not blocked, but your first comment did not show up. Uh, Miss Lola say, that is right. We over here moisturizing. <laughs> Miss Lola, moisturizing, beautifying, and minding our business. Cha-ching! That part, Miss Lola. Girl, we over here moisturizing. I'm, I'm gonna moisturize this skin. I'm trying to beautify myself, girl. I'm trying to become a better me. I'm trying to look like a natural woman. <laughs> Miss, Miss Lola, I'm trying to look like a natural woman. <laughs> let the haters hate i feel like how someone feels about me i am not is not my business yeah that's i heard i heard some things on that 
on Instagram, them little things be, and it was like, how somebody feel about me? It's a girl. That is not my business. I'm not checking for what you think about me. I'm not checking for what you say about me. I'm not checking for how you feel about me. Because if you feel some kind of way about me, you shouldn't be thinking about me. If you feel some kind of way about me, you shouldn't be thinking about me. You shouldn't be talking about me. And your show shouldn't be looking at me, girl. <laughs> that is right, Miss Lola. Mm, I did my nails last night. Fabulous, girl. Yes, I just did my nails today, girl. I'm trying to look like a natural woman. Girl, I, I'm trying to look like a woman. I'm trying to look like a lady. <laughs> I am sitting here drinking apple martini. Now, I've never had a martini before. What does a martini taste like? I always wanted... to try a martini maybe i need to go find a happy hour somewhere i always want to try a martini y'all uh i always wanted to contact i always wanted to try a martini You want my attention? You come into my live and you're typing in my live and think I care? <laughs> you is really pressed, child. You pressed. Y'all need a life. Y'all need some business. Girl, I'm sitting over here. Y'all be wanting to know how my skin is so pretty. I am sitting over here prettifying. <laughs> Miss Lola, I am prettifying my skin. I am over here getting beautimous, girl. I'm going to be beautimous after this is over with. I'm almost through with my little drink. Y'all got any plans for the weekend? If y'all don't get snowed in. Some of y'all getting snowed. Getting snow. Who had snow, y'all? Somebody had hell. One of my subscribers is in Chicago and they had snow yesterday. I can't I can't be living in them kind of climates. I can't be living in them climates, y'all. Thumbs up the live stream. Thumbs up the live stream. I can't be living in them climates. So I'm going to let this dry. I like my mask to dry like really, really, really hard. I made up a lot of extra masks because I'm probably just going to throw this whole thing away and just wash my spoon. But extra masks fell up in there. I had enough to do my hands and my feet probably. But yeah. Okay, what happened? Y'all stop talking to me. What happened, everybody? I ain't, it ain't showing no more comments. What's the Donkey Kong going on? What in the Donkey Kong is going on? Having a North Star heavy rain. Very, very, very windy. Did uh the eclipse pass already? When is the eclipse, y'all? Did it pass already? I probably missed it and didn't even know. I don't know nothing about no eclipse. <laughs> I will put that mask on my legs since it's worn outside. You have great legs. Thank you, Miss Lola. It's a gift from God. Thank you. Somebody had left a comment on the channel and was like, oh, you got a good, a nice walk. I'm like, what are they talking about? 
I'm bow legged, I'm slew foot, I'm pigeon toed. <laughs> oh, oh Lord. Somebody asked me, are you bow legged? Why your camera be rocking when you girl, I am bow legged, slew foot, pigeon toed, knock kneed. <laughs> I could hear Miss, I could hear Miss uh, Charlene right now saying, "Dang, <laughs> Miss Charlene, I am bow-legged, pigeon-toed, knock-kneed, slew-footed." <laughs> and it's the truth. I'm bow-legged, knock-kneed, slew-footed, pigeon-toed. Girl, I got every kind of foot problem that's known to man. But by the grace of God, I'm still walking, talking. I could still hike and bike, even though I'm pigeon toed, knock kneed, slew footed. What else is there, y'all? What else is there besides uh, bow leg, pigeon toe, knock kneed, slew footed? What else is there? <laughs> Miss Charlene say all of the above. All of the above for who? Me or you? <laughs> Let me see. Is Miss Charlene throwing some shade at me? All of the above for who? You or me, Miss Charlene? That's me or you? <laughs> no response is a response. And it drives people crazy. LOL. It is April and that springtime. But we can, any kind of weather here in Ohio, just wait and it will change for you. Apparently, it's not showing your comment. It depends on what you're typing. It depends on what you're typing. Uh, slew footed. <laughs> what you, Miss Miss Queen B is laughing. <laughs> How has your day been good, girl? I done gave myself a manicure, a pedicure. Now we're doing the facial, and we're gonna do some makeup. Who is excited to see me with some makeup on, girl? My self care day was going to the gynecologist and having my yearly checkup. Okay, Miss Marie, that is definitely some good self-care. Miss Charlene, who you talking about? All of the above. All of the above for you or me? You talking about me or you, girl? <laughs> Miss Charlene. <laughs> Miss Charlene throwing some shade at me, y'all. I am knock need. Oh, yeah. Knock need. Put this in the chat, y'all. I'm knock kneed, knock kneed, pigeon toe, slew footed, bow legged, and what's one more? Is can y'all think of any more? Uh, or two more? Can y'all think of two more, girl? Girl, I am all of the above. Yes, I am. Knock kneed, slew foot, pigeon toed. I already know. I know my faults. I am not in denial. <laughs> Miss Charlene, are you over there saying, dang? <laughs> I know Miss Charlene. Miss Charlene saying, <laughs> dang, that's a lot. <laughs> I just, Miss Charlene over there saying, <laughs> I just thought she was bow legged, <laughs> duck footed. <laughs> Miss Charlene over there saying, I just thought she was bow legged. No, girl. I am bow legged, slew footed, pigeon toed, knock kneed. And what was the other one? <laughs> What's another one? <laughs> duck footed. Ain't slew footed and duck footed the same thing, girl? I'm counting them all, all together. Slew footed and duck footed. This thing keep going off. Wow, what did I do? Why did I turn that thing off? 
note to self. Don't do that again, Vanessa. Flat footed, flat footed. Girl, I, I got it all going on. Yep, I think my feet are flat. I think I got flat feet, slew fitted, pigeon toed, knock knee, bow legged. <laughs> But you know what? The men be liking it, baby. I used to never wear shorts and dresses because I had infertitis. And hey, Vanessa, my husband and I just purchased a fifth wheel. And magically, you came up in our recommended feed. I love your spirit. Thank you, Miss Tracy. I appreciate it, girl. Subscribe to the channel. I appreciate it, girl. I'm just sitting in my van. I do van life. And I also have a travel trailer as well. A camper trailer. But to all my new subscribers who keep saying, Vanessa, where is your trailer? I thought you had a tiny home. Girl, yes, I do have a camper trailer. I do have a tiny home. But I live in my van the majority of the time. The tiny home is just going to be like a summer get away when I'm tired, when I'm on the road and I'm tired of being on the road and I'm tired of the rigamen roll and I just want to sit down. Girl, I might sit down a month out the year, two months out the year, three, four months. I don't know, but it's, it's, it's all about how I feel, you know, but I want to be on the road. On the road again. I'm on the road the majority of the time. I'm a van lifer. No family to help take care of you. What are you talking about, Miss Web Feet? What are you talking about, Miss uh, Miss Marie? I'm not understanding your partial comments. You do have some nice legs, Miss Vanessa. Oh, y'all like my legs? Don say I joined last week and I already have. 27 uh 2700 points girl that is good keep scanning them receipts y'all can also if y'all like to play games on y'all phones delete all them apps to the games that you're playing on your phones and go to fetch and they have some games you can play on fetch and you actually get points from playing them games so you can get points from playing games on fetch y'all i'm about to get out the van and show y'all my legs since y'all think of my legs so cute girl i want to i want some more compliments i want some more compliments <laughs> look i want some more compliments y'all let me show y'all my bow leg <laughs> let me show y'all my bow leg my pigeon toe my slew and let me tell i need y'all to tell me if i'm lying tell me if I'm really bow leg, slew footed, pigeon toed, knock kneed, <laughs> flat footed, y'all tell me, tell me, tell me. I don't know if y'all can see. Tell me. Look, I got that that mask. I'm gonna scare somebody. Y'all, I got that mask on my face. Tell me if I'm really knock need. <laughs> what is what is knock need? Is that is that knock need? Tell me if I'm really knock need. I think this is pigeon toed. Yeah, I used to be all of the above. I'm not lying to you. I used to be all of the above you do have okay y'all was supposed to be telling me if i'm pigeon toe bow bow legged knock kneed slew footed they are nice and long girl that's what the men say <laughs> that's what the man look that's what the men say girl come over here with them long legs girl i'll be like i'm 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 mostly legs y'all my daddy used to call me Greyhound. He told me I had legs like a Greyhound. 
That's what he. That's what he said. He said I had legs like a greyhound. I guess that was a compliment, cause them greyhounds be winning some races, huh? Them greyhounds. Be winning some races. Okay. Y'all just talking noise with y'all. Uh a tiny bit bow leg. Oh yeah, I'm bow leg for sure. I used to be really, really, really bow when I was a baby. My Legs made a circle. When they put me on the bed, my legs made a circle. That's what they tell me. And they was like, the doctors didn't think I was gonna like walk or something or I was gonna like, cause my legs made a circle when I, when they put me on the bed. Uh, I love the t-shirt. This is from Timu. This whole outfit is one of the Timu outfits, y'all. A little bow leg and not sure about knock need. Now, don't you scare anyone passing by, girl? Uh, a car slowed down, looking at me. <laughs> they probably calling the police and say, "I just seen Freddy Krueger." <laughs> uh, no, honey, you ain't. You. Ain't fine as wine. I ain't or I is. I'm fine as wine or I'm not. I'm not fine as wine or I is. <laughs> Period. Period. What? Fish grease. Vanessa, close the door for someone to see you with that mask on. Girl, my door is wide open. I am facing the forest. But I did just go outside. But my van is facing the forest and the trees. So yeah. But I like this to get hard. So let me get Now I'm going to let my ice melt. I can put some water in here. Or just let that melt and drink it. Okay, now I need to get my black bucket that I bathe out of. So I can get some water. On my face, and instead of hot water, today we're gonna use cold water. Oh, I just hit my arm. We're gonna use cold water and room temperature water. <sighs> I'm just chilling with my girls today. I'm just chilling with my girls. Thank y'all for keeping me company no matter what I do. Yes, you are fine as wine. I'm fine as wine, Miss Laurel. Girl, I don't have no booty. I am flat. I am flat. It's a pancake, girl. I don't have no booty, but who in here don't have no booty? Girl, we gonna build the booty this summer. I'm about to start working out and I'm gonna show y'all how to build the booty. Okay. We gonna build us a booty. We gonna be fine as wine, girl. <laughs> Look, we gonna be fine as wine and we ain't gonna have to pay a dime. <laughs> No LIFO, no uh, BBL, 
Nope, girl, we're going to be fine as wine. Who want to get fine as wine? I'm going to show y'all how to get fine as wine, girl. I'm trying not to whip my Band-Aid. I cut my hand earlier, y'all. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to put this on my face. Ooh. And let that I'm trying to find me a nice skincare system. Ooh, let's get them on now. Yeah, I was watching something on YouTube earlier. I be watching them uh them things be coming up in my feed cuz if I watch one then they keep coming up in my feed like the true crimes and the and this thing came up in my feed about these two brothers that offed their whole family. Oh they offed five people in their family. Two survived. And then they was getting ready to go on a mass spree. After they offed their family. And I keep thinking about that because that is so disturbing. So, 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 so disturbing. You are still beautiful and I don't have no but. Mine is flat as a board too. You know that you can buy a booty and I don't mean a BBL. I built up a little booty dancing four times a week. Yes, Miss Tracy girl. You could dance. You can build a booty. I'm going to show y'all how to build a booty. My booty going to be saying, pow, y'all. Y'all going to be like, where that booty came from? Well, actually, I have a nice shape, y'all. Once I slim down in my waist, then my butt is more defined. I wasn't built to have a big Judy booty. <laughs> Judy with the big fat booty. <laughs> I wasn't built to, oh, my polish is coming off already. I wasn't built to have a Judy with the big fat booty, but I'm a slender built. And I like slender built because, like, the more slender built you are, to me, that's the shape that I like is a slender built. Like Miss Charlene and Miss Pauline. They petite. And they have a slender built. And to me, their clothes look good on them. I think... The smaller you are, the more slender you are. Your clothes look better on you. And, girl, when you go to the thrift store. When I be going to the thrift store, I be finding all kind of clothes for small people. Size 2, 3, and 4. And I be like, ooh, I wish. You know, but I've been, the smallest I've been is a size 4, 6. That's the smallest I've been. And I think the biggest I've been is a size 14. I've never been like fat, fat, but I've looked large before because I had a lot of fluid on me. After my gallstone surgery, 
And I don't know, some people who have had the gallstone surgery, which I got a lot of people in my chat who've had the gallstone surgery. After I had the gallstone surgery, I gained weight. I gained weight and I had a lot of fluid on me. So I looked swollen. Anybody going to do any self-care with me today? Oh, the polish is coming straight off. Girl, I might have to do my nails again. The polish coming straight off, y'all. We might have to do our nails again. My skin is feeling a little irritated. Y'all still there? I feel like I'm gonna still want something to eat tonight. I'm probably. Gonna warm with me some liver and onions. Okay, I think I got some mask. Oh, ooh, I got some mask on the back of my neck. I gained a lot of weight through pre-menopause. Yeah, I guess I'm going through menopause too because the monthly has stopped. It has stopped for almost a year and then I think it came back a couple of months ago out due to stress. And it's gone again, so I don't know. I don't know if I'm pre-menopause or menopausal. I don't know girl so I can't have no more kids I don't know why this thing keep going off y'all let me unplug the refrigerator I got this mask all up in my hair. In the back. It's like my skin is raw. I think I'm gonna put some oil. I have all kind of oils. Ooh. My skin is burning. My skin is on fire. Let me see. Oh, my skin is on fire. Liver and onion sound good. One of my favorite dishes. Girl, you already know. Liver and onion and bacon. I can't 
do it without the bacon. And I got bacon. I, I didn't put my blue cheese in the refrigerator last night. I hope it's still good. I hope it's still good. Okay. I don't know if I got everything off my face. I'm gonna get another bottle of water and uh, a new towel and wipe my face. My face feels really dry. I don't like that feeling. So what I'm gonna do is put some oil on it first and then I'm gonna let that oil stay on my face for a little minute. So let me throw this away. Let me check my comments. I am here making air fried chicken. I'm sized for dinner. It feels like I am sitting with you in the van. Girl, yes, come on in. 
come on in, girl. We doing van life. Everybody give Miss Vanessa a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up, girl. I made chicken and dumpling. Is it cold where you at, Miss Marie? Is it cold where you at? Oh, Lord, my finger bleeding again. I took that Band-Aid off. Let me put this Band-Aid back on. Let me... Clean it off with some alcohol again. Ooh, ah, ah! Oh, that burns. Ugh. Okay, my nail polish is all jacked up. I'm going to have to paint my nails again. Because they all jacked up. I wash, I keep my hands in water too much. keep my hands in water too much. So I'm going to get some oil. I got all kind of oils that I put on my face and everywhere else. And I take uh, walnut oil. Olive oil, avocado oil. So let's see what we can find. I don't know if these two look alike. I don't know what's what. I don't know what I have. I'm gonna smell them and see if they're the same. We're gonna use this. Right here, it had it has list in it. I don't know what that smell like. This one smells like regular olive oil. I'm gonna put this on my hand as well. Then when I get ready to wash this off, I'll get another towel and some more water. But I'm gonna let this sit on for a while. Just cause my skin feels like it's on fire. I feel like I still got a little mask up in here somewhere. Okay, so let me smell this. It don't smell like nothing. It kind of smell like olive oil. So let me see what this smell like. If this smells different. This is walnut oil. I think I got that written. Yeah, this smells different. This is walnut oil. Uh-oh. I'm gonna put this on my hands. Maybe I won't do makeup tonight, but I probably will because I want to film some videos. Or maybe I wake up early in the morning. I might wake up early in the morning. I just might make this just my relaxation. And let me massage my hands. So, okay, this was walnut oil and I think olive oil. Walnut oil helps you sleep and you could take it to externally. I need to start like, taking my oils. Oh, I'm getting. So this oil kind of smells, they all smell a little different. I'm getting stuff in my eyes.
I'm going to let this oil sit on me for quite some time, y'all. And I'm about to give myself a hand massage and a face massage. I'm going to take this oil from close around my eyes. So I can open my eyes. Hey, Miss Rally, say we are under the weather storm advisory. If you blink really fast in a part of New York, I live in spring will be over with. <laughs> Our winter is like hold my bear. Let me show you what we do. Still making a run to CVS. Girl, do you be couponing at CVS? Do you scan your card, Miss Davina? Girl, you better scan your card to be getting them coupons. I used to uh, be an extreme couponer. Walgreens, CVS, Kroger's, and Walmart was my main places I like the coupon so yeah I'm about to just give myself a massage massage this into my hands my arms my fingers and all of these oils are good for your body so I'm just gonna let this sit on here for a minute and I'm probably not gonna do my makeup tonight because now I'm just in a relaxed mood. Who wants to put on makeup only to take it right back off? No, I'm going to wake up in the morning and put on some makeup. So I'm going to be live on Vanessa VIPB in the morning. If I do anything else tonight, I might do my nails over, but I doubt it. I'm just going to let this oil... See, I think I got some some mask right there. I'm just going to let this all sit on my skin. Seep in my skin. Nourish my skin. Replenish my skin. Mm. And just enjoy it and relax. Child, we need to learn how to Relax. I have to learn how to do a lot of stuff because a lot of stuff wasn't taught to me and didn't come naturally. Like, my mama didn't teach her daughters how to be feminine, how to be a woman, how to be. Like, we didn't get that from her. She didn't teach us how to do that. Uh, she didn't teach us nothing. She didn't teach us anything.
So that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to chill with the rest of this oil on my face, y'all. I'm going to look oily for the rest of the night. I might even go to sleep in this. Uh, I got monthly massages. What part of the country are you in? I am in Texas, girl. I am in Texas. Might be leaving Texas by the end of the month. Might be heading back to Arizona or Nevada or California or Colorado. I don't know. I might need to watch some videos. That's probably what I'll do for the rest of the night. Yeah, I used to put this uh, as a part of self-care. Put this all on my face and my neck every night. Uh, walnut oil helps you sleep and helps with a lot of different things. I need to start back taking my oils and I need to start back putting my oils on. I got a lot of oils, so I need to start back using my oils. So I'm gonna sleep with this oil on my skin tonight. So we're not doing makeup. Y'all got anything y'all wanna talk about? Anything going on in the news? Anything going on in your life? Anything you need prayer for? Anything y'all want to talk about? Open forum. Let me know. Y'all got any questions y'all want to ask Vanessa? Ask Vanessa. You have any hypothetical questions you want to ask me about something that's going on in your life or somebody you know that you might want to answer to? Like, say for instance, I have a girlfriend that's cheating on her husband. <laughs> what should I do? <laughs> she cheating on her husband first of all you need to find out is she cheating on her husband with your husband because see if you approve her foolishness then that means she could be fooling around with your husband girl uh-uh you better get away from that chick i am following the case of the young boy that is missing in tennessee What's your major expenses? My my expenses are car insurance, cell phone, internet. When I have my internet, I turned off my Nomad internet while I'm traveling. Uh, gym membership and gas and... Uh, Fees to the state parks. So those are my... And food, of course. Those are my main expenses. How is dating while traveling? I wouldn't know. I don't date. I'm single, celibate, and living for Jesus. And I'm not interested in a relationship, girl. Uh, how old is too old for you to van life? I don't think there's such thing as old, too old. If you can get around, if you can still drive, if you not see now and, and, and losing your mind and forgetting where you at, then you can do van life if you want to. I'm sure it's some people in their 80s doing van life. Like, I know that there's a lady that does van life and she's a senior citizen all hair is white there's several people that do van life a lot the majority of people that do van life are elderly if y'all do not know i think the statistics would probably prove that probably more than 75 percent of people that do van life is probably over 60 to 70 years old so there are a lot a lot of elderly people doing van life and I don't think there is no such thing as too old to do van life. Uh, considering that it's probably more old people doing van life than the youngsters. Mail service. 
Uh, I have a my mail service with don't get your mail service with the post office. You post office sends your mail back after 15 days. Uh, get your mail service with a place that has mail service that is not going to return your mail and going to hold your mail for you. I have my mail service with mail messages and more in Pahrump, Nevada. She is an excellent mail service. She's not going to send your mail back and uh yeah and she will send your mail to you wherever you're at so you can receive your mail there but she, if you're somewhere else she could send it to you so i like mail messages and more in nevada and i also have a mail service in texas those are two expenses for me which is probably over four hundred dollars close to five hundred dollars for the year per year from my mail service. Miss uh, Taronda say, girl, girl, what? What is funny? Complete sentence, please. What's funny? Can y'all answer me in complete sentences? Because I don't know what y'all laughing at. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what your problem is. <laughs> What did I say that was funny? Do I have to pay a lot fee for what? Hey, Miss Laurel. Do I have to pay a lot fee for what? Y'all thumbs up the live stream if you haven't already. You say you live for Jesus and no dating. That's the truth, girl. I've been celibate for over 10 years. Over 10 years, girl. I don't want no man, no woman. No nothing. I ain't interested. I ain't interested. <laughs> I just have friends, male friends, female friends, not friends with benefits. We don't do the benefits, girl. The only benefit to having a friend is that what a friend we have in Jesus, but not no friends with no other kind of benefits. What? I love it. Miss Laurel, pay rent, lot rent for what? I don't know what you talking about. Do I pay lot rent for what? I got somebody passing by. But I guess if you wanted to date while single, while doing van life, you could. You could find somebody to date while you... Yeah, you could find a man or a woman anywhere. I don't think it's hard to date. And they got all these apps. Y'all be careful on them apps. I don't believe in apps. But be careful. Whatever you choose to do, especially doing van life, and dating people don't let nobody in your home don't let nobody in your van home don't be having no one night stands in your van in your van don't be girl don't do that that is so dangerous like i wouldn't do it if i was dating while i was doing van life i would meet people out in the public and they would never even know that i did van life I would not let them know where I live at. I would not let them know who I am, what I do, none of that. Mm -mm, none of that. That is dangerous. I just wouldn't do it. I'm so glad I don't date and I'm not dating. I don't have to worry about all of that stuff. I'm through with dating. I'm just not interested. 
And I thank God for taking that desire away from me. Uh, he probably didn't want to take it, but I wanted him to take it. So I'm glad he obliged me and took that desire away. Uh, yep, I I be scanning my coupons. Uh, how long have I been doing van life? In June, on June the 30th, it's going to be three years. Uh, I started van life because I think I was meant to do van life. Uh, it was something that I would have did a long time ago if I would have knew what van life was. And I just think it was meant and intended for me to do van life. I chose to do van life for my peace, my happiness, my healing. And I'm glad I found van life. I'm happy. I was laughing at what you were said. I don't know about dating because I am not interested. We know we have been here long enough to know that dating is not what you what's on your agenda girl now if you a rich man who want to buy me a new van holla if you a rich man that want to buy me a new van i will cook for you massage you visit you every now and then talk to you and treat you nice but then i'm gonna get in my van and say bye yeah i see you every i see you when i see you but you ain't you ain't getting nothing you ain't getting none but i treat you i'll be your best friend i'm gonna be a good woman to you but if you a man that want to uh, yeah if you a good man that want to buy me a van hit me up vanessa's van life journey at yahoo.com <laughs> Uh, I have been married to the same man for 30 years. Bless your heart. <laughs> Bless your heart, Miss Marie. More power to you, girl. I am so happy for you. I am so, so happy. Marriage is a beautiful thing. But living for Jesus has so many more benefits. I'm just happy. I am married. I am married, but I'm married to the Lord. He's a great man. I'm happy you found your soulmate, girl. But I'm married. I'm married to the Lord. That's why I'm not going to cheat on him. And that's why I'm not interested in a relationship because I'm married to Jesus. And I want to keep it that way. You ain't getting none. Girl, I am screaming. Nope, getting none. Getting some what? No, he ain't getting none. <laughs> but he could buy me a new van, but he ain't gonna get none. Mm -mm. But I, you know, see, men need to. If you get you a good woman that's gonna cook, clean, massage you, pluck your eyebrows, pick your your hairs, your ingrown hairs. Forget about sex. Forget about sex. Be concerned about the woman being a good woman. A lot of people put the cart before the horse and they build the relationship based on sex instead of building a relationship based on friendship and love and respect. Like, I'm never, ever having sex outside of marriage again. So, I know you ain't getting none in a casual relationship. And then, if we get married, I got to think about it. I'm going to have to think about it. But I'm still going to be doing what I want to do. So, if I had to get married and my husband wanted me to settle down and not do van life. And he didn't want to do van life with me. That is not happening. Do you know, I know so many people out there that come to my channel. They want to do van life. But their partner, not interested. And so you have to cater to your partner. Girl, I am so happy I'm not married. What I look like marrying a man? And then he say, well, I don't want to do van life. Okay, I'm, I'm going to be gone. Then he going to be like, well, you my wife. You can't do van life. Now, 
I was doing van life before I met you. I'm still going to do van life. I'm not getting married to stop doing what I want to do. My husband and I read our Bible together every day and do devotions. Uh, I am done. Miss Taronda say, I am done. You can get a pat on the back and a promise. LOL. Uh, that's not what the Bible says about a relationship between a man and a woman and sex. What's not what the Bible says? What's not what what's not what the Bible says? What's not what the Bible says? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I'm not interested in no relationship, y'all. I'm good. Like why bring confusion to the table when you're already at peace? Like, people that are searching for a relationship is missing something. They're missing something. They're looking for something. They want something. I'm not missing anything, so I'm not looking for a relationship. I'm not missing anything. I don't want anything. I don't desire anything. So... I'm not looking for a relationship to make me complete because I feel complete. All I need is Jesus and I feel complete. God is giving me everything that I need. That is true. Marriage is a compromise. Marriage is a ministry. Marriage is a ministry. If you are not willing to be married, if you're not willing to be in a ministry, ministry is a 24-hour commitment. If you're not ready for a ministry, do not get married. And then when you ask about dating and van life, I am a Christian. And so dating outside of the will of God is not something that I would be willing to do. Having sex outside of marriage, casual sex with strangers outside of marriage is not something that I'm interested in. So I'm not interested in the whole dating scene, period. Like, whew, I'm so over it. I am so over it, girl. I am over that theory. Whew, there was once upon a time I wanted to be married, but not no more. I think the last time I thought about marriage was probably about 10, 15 years ago. Ain't thought about it since then, girl. But to all you people out there that are married in a relationship and desire marriage, I respect your choices and your decisions. I'm not trying to talk nobody out of being married and being in a relationship i will try to talk you out of being in a unholy and sinful relationship like sex before marriage is not the will of god fornicating committing adultery is not the will of god i will advise you to seek god in all things and wait on him to send you your mate so i will advise that but i'm not talking you out if you get married and you find your soulmate, that is good. But the Bible says it is even better for a man to remain single and alone if he can. A lot of people want to use that scripture and say uh, it's better to marry than to burn. It's better to marry than to burn if you can't sustain from sex. But you don't just get married only for sex. And a lot of people do. They get married because they want companionship and they want sex. Not because of the commitment, the long haul, the relationship, the, uh, the uh, oath that you make between a man and a wife. A lot of people get married just for sex. And that's why they break the oath of marriage. Because they didn't do it for the right reason to begin with.
I completely understand. Uh, Miss uh, Miss Doris say, Miss Marie, I was married for 50 years, lost my husband in 2004. I miss marriage sometimes, but not enough to do it. <laughs> not enough to do it again. And you have to do what's right for you. You have to do what's right for you. We are all individuals with individual needs, individual desires, and individual calls on our lives. And so you have to do what's best for you. And I would say seek God in all that you do. Don't listen to me. Don't listen to a friend. Don't listen to a family member. Follow after God. So, child, ain't nobody trying to date in no van. Not I said the little red hand. Mm -mm, that's the last thing on my mind. Is a man. But if some rich man out there want to buy me a van, hit me up. Hit me up. I know it's a particular man that watches me. Uh... He has his own business and he lives in California. If you are watching, I would be very interested in meeting you. So email me at Vanessa's Van Life Journey at yahoo.com and you know who you are. I would be very interested in meeting you and uh, helping you with your business so as you can see i have many skills in your area of expertise so if you are watching me email me at vanessa's van life journey at yahoo.com and uh i'll be willing to talk to you and facetime you and let's see what we can do to make some money together uh yeah i'll come help you with your business okay Okay. <laughs> uh, is Marie still there? Hello. <laughs> Tracy say. <laughs> Tracy say no. No what, Tracy? Tracy say no. No what, Tracy? Tracy, what is you laughing at? <laughs> what is you laughing at? <laughs> I make my own self laugh, y'all. laugh huh that is so funny that is so funny I'm trying to find out what Tracy laughing at talking about no Anyway, y'all, I'm just sitting here acting crazy, having fun. It ain't nothing wrong with a good laugh. I'm my own entertainment. I don't need nobody else to keep me entertained, to keep me laughing. I don't get bored. Like, I don't need a lot of y'all say, when are you going to get a dog? Why don't you get a dog? Why don't you get a cat? Why don't you get a pet? I don't need nothing to, I don't get lonely. I don't get lonely. I don't need to get a dog or a cat or a bird or a snake or a man to keep me company. I don't get bored. I don't get lonely. I don't. Child, I'm good. Mm -mm. I have a, a hard enough time devoting my time to myself. 
Vanessa, you cannot have a rich man buy you a van and not share those beautiful legs. He could watch these legs all day, every day, girl. I will wear some shorts while we working. He could look at these legs all day, every day. He gonna see him walking by, coming and going. <laughs> Uh, Miss Doris say your lives are so much fun. Thank you, Miss Doris. He gonna see them legs coming and going. He could see them coming and going every day. He buy me a van. Uh, I'll let you see these legs for a year. Coming and going. Girl, I'm talking about working. I am not talking about... Uh, yeah. I'll be, I be a caregiver... You know, men, some people have nurses, caregivers, uh, a personal chef. I'll be, a, I'll be your maid. I'll cook. I'll clean. I'll wash your clothes. I'll clean your house for one year, and then I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. I'm going to pay for the van. One year, cooking and cleaning. But if you crazy, if you crazy, I ain't taking no bull crap. I'm just gonna tell you, if you crazy, and I just, I have, I need a contract. This is not no sexual contract. This is a business contract. Can he at least? No, girl, ain't nobody touching my legs. He could suck my toes. <laughs> he can suck my toes <laughs> uh, Miss Tracy what is the, what kind of agenda are you on up over there Miss, Tra Miss Tracy trying to get me to sin y'all <laughs> she trying to get me to sin girl I am not sinning I've been celibate for over 10 years we is not going back, Jack. Tell me, can't he at least touch your legs? Girl, he could get kicked by my feet. He could suck my toes, and that's it. That is it. <sighs> Why y'all got me talking crazy? Changing the conversation. Next. <laughs> Miss Tracy talking about no, he could suck my toes. That's it. That's all oh, he. That's the closest he gonna get to my legs. Okay. I don't know why you trying to get somebody close to my legs, Miss Tracy. I don't know why she up here trying to get me to give up my legs. Wow, Miss Tracy, what is the donkey cone is going on? Not the toes. My daughter said, Mom, who are you? <laughs> Miss Doris, you got me where other people can hear me. <laughs> My daughter said, Mom, who are you listening to? Because I am screaming. <laughs> Tell her it's just some old crazy lady on YouTube. Some crazy lady on YouTube who live in the van, who don't have a television, and she trying to keep from being bored right now. She up here entertaining y'all. See, this is why I don't need no TV. I don't need no man. I don't need no cats. I don't need no dogs. Because, girl, I have a sense of humor. I don't get bored. I keep my own self preoccupied. So, anyway, tell your daughter I said hi, girl. Tell her to subscribe to the channel. Vanessa's Van Life Journey and Vanessa VIPB. Tell her to subscribe to the channel. We always having fun over here. We always having laughs.
Okay, I thought I had a bag with some trash in it. But now I don't see what I did with the bag. Okay, y'all, I do want y'all to know. I don't know what's going on. I didn't take my, did I take my iodine today? I don't even know. I don't know what's going on, but I'm hungry again. I am hungry again. Okay, um, I will because she came into my room being nosy. She heard me all the way. You must have me on the TV, Miss Doris. Do you have me up on the TV, girl? Y'all better be putting some earplugs in when y'all listening to me. Because ain't no telling what is going to come out of my mouth. But y'all do know I just be playing, right? Y'all know I y'all do know I just be playing, right? Y'all don't know what's gonna come out of my mouth. Anybody got anything else? Any other questions? Any other topics of conversation you want to talk about? Anything else you would like me to give you my opinion on? I'm going to keep this all on my face for the rest of the night. I'm going to wake up early in the morning, whatever time I wake up on Vanessa VIPB. And I'm going to go live and I'm going to do my makeup in the morning. Uh, I'm probably going to do my morning prayer. I've been getting up at like 4 and 5 in the morning. I wanted to come live this morning at like 4 to do the morning prayer. But I didn't. But I'm probably going to do that in the morning. Come live with my morning prayer. Then come back eat breakfast do my makeup excuse me no my phone but I don't think she was paying attention she knows that I follow people on YouTube well yeah I'm a whole character I'm a whole character I don't have a filter but I don't think you should filter out being fun. I have a filter when I need one, but like, I don't think you, I, I don't need a filter. I'm just being myself. I'm in my house right now. I don't need a filter in my house. And whoever watching me, you're bringing me into your home. You're coming into my home. So I don't need no filter into my own home. Do I? Do I need a filter in my own house? I don't think so. So anyway. Anybody else got any other questions? Anything y'all want to talk about? Anything y'all want my opinion on? If y'all not going to talk to me, I'm going to go ahead and end the live. If y'all not going to talk to me, I'm going to end the live.
Hold on, y'all. I'm checking. I'm hoarding comments on the channel. If y'all haven't checked out the video from this morning, check it out. Okay, let me see what y'all saying. Uh, hey, Miss Melissa. Hey, Miss Melissa, come on in here and talk to me, girl. These people ain't talking to me. I don't have a filter either. There's nothing wrong with a little fun. Miss Melissa, come talk to me. If they ain't gonna talk to me, then I'm gonna end the live. If y'all don't wanna have no more fun. If y'all don't have no more questions, if y'all don't have need no advice on nothing, I'm gonna end the live. Uh, so if y'all wanna talk, I don't have to go nowhere. We can stay live for another hour or two. But if y'all ain't talking to me, then I'ma go. I'ma go watch some YouTube videos on Colorado. find out a little bit by Colorado if y'all don't want to talk to me. Vanessa, what type of exercise? I don't really exercise. Hey, Miss uh, Mathis. I don't really exercise, but when I do, I walk. I hike. I like jump roping. My favorite exercises in home life was jump roping and climbing stairs. So those are my favorite exercises. Y'all come on in and talk to me. What are you up to, girl? I just got through doing a manicure, a pedicure, a facial. Now I have all on my face. I was gonna do my makeup, but I'm gonna do my makeup tomorrow on Vanessa VIPB. I'm gonna come live in the morning, do my morning prayer, in that live, come back, fix breakfast, and do my makeup. So if y'all wanna see me do my makeup tomorrow, then come on in, girl. This Band-Aid is not staying on because it got oil all on it. I think I need a new Band-Aid. But yeah, I could stay live and talk to y'all if y'all want to talk. But if ain't nobody going to be talking, then I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave if y'all ain't talking. If I got to wait five minutes for a question, then I'm just going to end the live. Make, make day tomorrow. I'll be there. Make up day tomorrow. Yeah, in the morning sometime. I don't know. I'm going to do the morning prayer, motivational talk, morning prayer. And then after that, I'll end the live, come back, fix breakfast, do my makeup. And I'm going to fix the ground beef and the uh, ground beef and eggs in the morning. I knew what you meant, Miss, uh, I knew what you meant, Miss Melissa, how everything been going with y'all. 
I don't know why my thing keep. Let me check and check my solar. I don't know why my thing keep going off. Let's see what's going on. What's going on? Let's see if I can close this thing up. Is this thing up? Let me see if the thing gonna keep flashing. Everything is okay. Been busy with physical therapy. Other than that, okay. Well, I'm glad everything is going well. And I keep you in my prayers. And you know I love you. Appreciate you for coming in and being here with me. And I'm just trying to keep my head above water stay focused on the things of God get closer to God be a better steward over the things that God has given me my relationships uh, my belongings my health you know the first thing that we need to be better stewards over that God blesses us with every single day is our life. God blesses us every day to wake up in the morning and we need to be better stewards over the gifts that God give us. Like some people, God wake up every day and they just throw away the blessings of God on foolishness every day. It's such a shame, it's such a waste. It's such a shame. It's such a waste. So I don't want to waste the health and the strength that God give me every day and just throw it away on foolishness. I don't want to do that. So I want to be a better steward. I want to be more effective in my ministry be more effective with my communication be more effective as a Christian as a friend as a encouragement and motivation to others I want to be more effective I want to be a more effective Christian with in my relationship with God I just you know, time is winding up. It's time out for foolishness. I don't know why they think he's doing that. It wasn't doing that at first. I turned this thing off. And now it started doing that. I don't know why it's doing it. God first, yes. So I polished my toenails. They look a hot mess because polish is everywhere. So I need to take a Q-tips and clean up the polish from around them. I need to clean up the polish. But yeah, I've pretty much been live all day. Would you have ever host a Bible study? We're supposed to be, I'm supposed to be a part of my changes to my channel is I am doing a morning prayer every morning, a motivational 
message and a morning prayer, then I'm supposed to be reading a Bible scripture. After that, do a video reading a Bible scripture and do a Bible verse of the day. So that's going to be on my other channel. Which channel am I on? I'm on Vanessa Van Life Journey of VIPB. Uh, oh, I'm on Vanessa. So that's all on Vanessa's VI Vanessa VIPB. So if you're not subscribed to Vanessa VIPB, I can post my morning prayer from this morning. A lot of people say they got blessed from this morning's prayer and the, the prayer for the last couple of days. I think the one from yesterday was good too. So if you're not subscribed to Vanessa's VIPB, Okay, so this is the morning prayer from yesterday. That's the morning prayer from yesterday. This is the morning prayer and motivational message from today. So if you're not subscribed to Vanessa VIPB, subscribe I don't know why that thing keep going out Ugh, that is about to be aggravating I'm gonna have to figure that out that's my fault I unplugged the doggone thing Anyway, if y'all don't have anything else y'all want to talk about or discuss, then I am going to end this live and call it a night. I might go watch Netflix. I might go watch some YouTube, but I'm going to call it a night if you guys are through with the chat so i appreciate y'all thank y'all for coming in hanging with me and i'm gonna talk to y'all later i'll see you guys in the morning i guess i'll call it a night and uh yeah i'll talk to y'all later thanks for watching bye i appreciate y'all Good night, Miss Melissa. Good night, Jordan. Good night, Miss Mathis. Good night, Miss Tracy. Enjoyed you being here. And I'll talk to you later. Bye. Y'all have a good evening.